attention has meant like an evolution, especially considering, you know, I came into the industry, I was very, very young, 15 years old, still trying to figure out who I was as a young woman, but also as my own artist. And now I have the opportunity to showcase that not only to the world, but also to myself. And so it's just really cool just to see the transformation and seeing the growth in such a short amount of time. You know, a lot of what I did when I was younger, like my parents, I could not keep still. I would be in the house tumbling, dancing. They were like, okay, we need to put this girl in something. So I was very used to doing multiple things at one time. And I don't know, I just always had just a work ethic and a want to be better and to be the best that I could possibly be. So I think that a lot of that kind of contributes into my artistry right now. Like I will have nights that I don't sleep it's the one thing that keeps me up at night, just to make sure that my vision comes to life. Not only for everybody else around me and my amazing fans who deserve nothing but the best, but also just to meet my expectation, which is so incredibly high. So as long as I match that in anything that I do, whatever I'm offering to the rest of the world, I'm happy with and I'm able to sleep at night. I wear so many different hats. Sometimes the manager has to tell me to calm down because <laughs> I'm not a control freak, but when it comes to my business, I just, I mean, I have a certain expectation and I like to make sure that things don't fall through. A lot of the time I have to step away and kind of silence everybody else's voice and think, okay, what is my goal? What's the ultimate? Where do I see the end all be all? And I think that it's a matter of getting everybody on your team on the same page as well and being able to recognize and respect that and make sure that they're working twice as hard as you. If everybody's not working twice as hard as you, if not harder, then it's not a match. I think back to me being a little girl and being able to see some of my favorite artists, young black women, which I hope to be the representation of today, you know, even for the next generation, to inspire them and let them know that they can also do what I'm doing. You know, I'm no different than they are. I'm a regular girl from the South who had a dream and I worked really, really hard. I had an amazing family and support system, thank God. But I'm no different. Just continue to work hard and, and remember that the possibilities are, are endless.